Howdy folks, I'm Score, the Crimson Renegade, and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep. Speaking of sleep, I've gotten some sleep, so I'm not so tired now. I can actually focus on what I'm doing. Let's see how I can figure out where the hell I'm supposed to be going. Last time I was lost as could be and couldn't figure out where I was supposed to be going. So I'm going to now backtrack, and we'll skip all these enemies for now, and see if I can figure out where I'm supposed to fucking be going. Excuse me, pardon me, coming through. Okay, I'm supposed to be finding the, uh, yeah. Ah, yeah. some, uh, yeah. materials for Cinderella, Cinderella's dress, so. And I think I found, like, two or three of them, I need to find, like, two more. And there we go. Okay. Oh, more enemies. Yeah, I'm not really sure. I haven't really done really look at the stat sheet to see the difference, but it seems like I'm doing more damage with Ventus with my physical attacks than I was with uh, Aqua in the previous uh, story. So I'm really wondering if uh, there actually is a stat difference, and maybe uh, Ventus has a more has a higher strength stat than uh, than Aqua, which would make sense if they actually you know keep the keep it accurate to what they said about her stats in the in the introduction. I said she was a gifted mage, which means she probably has a higher magic stat. Which would probably mean Terra would even have a higher strength stat than, uh... Excuse me a moment. Fuck you, I didn't want to talk to you either. <clears throat> yeah, as I was trying to say, uh, uh, Terra would probably have even a higher strength stat than, uh, Inventus. Okay, so do I have like a way to find out what I'm supposed to be doing? Uh, story? No. Okay. Nope. I guess I'm supposed to be just looking for stuff. <laughs> I think I see something on top of that desk up there. I wonder how do I get uh, on top of this uh, big round thing here. So how do I get up there to it? First, we kill the enemies here. Is this another hole? Oh, this is probably the house hole I came out of, isn't it? No? There's, a, there's another one over there. Maybe it's a different place. Hold on, let me check this mouse hole here. What is this? Okay, this is different. Okay, let's see what this is all about. Yeah, I definitely haven't been here because I didn't see these chests. Maybe this, maybe this winds around, maybe there's like a mouse hole up on top of where that, uh... Why is this shining? Whoa! Okay, that's what that does. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> and we jump on that fork. I'm, oh, I thought I missed. <clears throat> Okay, I just pushed that in for some reason. Why? Okay, I see. It gave me a path to jump across. Why do I need to break the cheese out of this spider web? Because it gave me access to down there. Do I go down there directly, or <clears throat> I guess I'd have to, because I don't see any other way over there. So down we go. No, go, go, go down, but uh, just go down. Thank you. Oh, I got another one of these things. Chocolate Valentine, rich marshmallow. The only one? 
I guess the things that give you those little items. I don't know what they're for, but... Hungry Crystal. Alright. These, these, uh... Oh, hello enemies. The, uh... The, ch the cheese blocks are there to jump on to get up to those other chests. That's all well and good, but that's not going to get me up to the... That dresser where I need to get that last item, or one, another item. Pulsing crystal. Ah, maybe it does, because here's a mouse hole here. Where does this lead? Wardrobe room. Right where I need to be. Awesome. Okay, here we go. Got the button. And we just need one more item, right? Okay. Okay, there's a treasure chest up there. I think I see... Okay, I clearly need to get up on top of that uh, dresser up there because I see that wood plank hanging out there that would be, require me to jump from there to over there. So I clearly need to get up there somehow. How would I go about doing that? Another question would be how would I get to that treasure chest that's right there on the other end of the room. Because I don't think I can get on top of the ball of yarn to reach the top of that uh, uh, box, but I guess we can try and find out after we eliminate these unversed. Alright, let me talk to him just a second. Maybe he can tell me, give me a hint. Pink threads on top of the shelf in the room downstairs. Okay, that's the one thing I'm missing. So I'm, I'm, I'm headed the right way. I just need to figure out how to get there. That's the problem. So I just can't get up there. I feel that's the way I should go, but I don't see any way to get up there. Well, I apologize for a semi-waste episode. I mean, I know I got one item, but I'm still missing that one other one, and I can't figure out how to get up to it. So I'm gonna have to give in and try to find and, and find a walkthrough because I'm I'm stumped. I'm stumped. I can't find any way up to it. And I'm sure it's gonna be something that's gonna be blatantly obvious, and I'm gonna be extremely extremely pissed off. But oh well. I can do about it at this point. I can't figure it out. Howdy, folks. I'm Score, the pissed off renegade. Welcome back to Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep. Just like I said, I'd finally look at the walkthrough, and sure enough, it was going to piss me off. And it did. It was fucking obvious. I had to go back to this mouse hole after all. And remember those forks that I was bouncing around on? Well, there's a path that leads around to the uh, to the opposite side of the room, despite what I said about this, this mouse hole not doing that exact thing. So I gotta jump on this fork, jump up here, land up here. And look, a path that leads around to the other side of the room. We go around here, this way. Deal with these guys real quick. Get rid of them all. Okay. Alright, jump down. Grab this item here. And look! Uh, hole to the wardrobe room. Where could this possibly lead? <sighs> I'm not happy. This is the jump button. Here we go. 
and examine. And there we go. Got them all. Well, now that I've got that part done, I'm going to go say and start to deal with that bullshit again and be right back. I'm back. Let's go find that pearl. <sighs> and beat up some un un uh, unversed along the way to vent some anger. Get it? Vent, to vent some anger? Oh, I'm still pissed off, so my jokes aren't that good. Okay, leave me alone. Hush over there. No. Oh, hey, look. A pearl next to a cat. I'm about the size of a mouse. Go figure. Oh. I guess this is yeah, Lucifer the cat. Funny how it looks just like Chester, the, uh, yeah. the, the smiling cat from Alice in Wonderland. The creepy cat. <laughs> Is this gonna be a boss fight? I guess it is a, a boss time. Want to fight a cat? <laughs> okay. Chase Lucifer off, dodges, pounces, and leap onto his back. All right. That's pretty high up. There you go. I want his back now. What is it? Oh, okay. I had to do a combination of button presses that I missed, so it was really interesting. Oh, damn it, but okay, they're gonna change the buttons every time. It's bullshit. Okay, he's up high now. Get ready for this. Oh, he's he's your own, own pounce. Let's go ahead and heal up while we got a moment here. Alright. Square. Triangle. Square. Triangle. Triangle. Calling out the commands is a really weird way to commentate a video, isn't it? Bronco strike. Got him. I learned diamond dust. I feel bad I beat up a kitty. Thanks needed. You saved me before, so I've saved you. That's what friends do, right? Now, let's get that dress finished. Obviously, this happens before Aqua uh, gets here because remember when Aqua's story, uh, Jock oh, mentions yeah. Ven. What's a royal ball? After all, I suppose it would be frightfully dull and. Boring and completely, completely wonderful. Cinderella! Is that my dress? Yes, it's a present from us. 
Now you have a dress for the ball. <laughs> Why, it's... it's such a surprise. Sorry, sorry. Time to go, Brenda, lady. Oh, thank you. Jack-Jack, hope a Brenda ready to ring come true. What's up, and to me? <laughs> that is not what the caption the caption said. Dreamed about. Well, you're, well, you're not, not the, the only, only one. one. I know. You, you me, and Ben, ben all share the same dream. dream. Funny. I'd never really thought about it. At least until you asked me. My dream is to become a Keyblade Master. Hope a Ben Ben dream come true too. I just need to keep on believing. Right? Yes, sir. <laughs> We're to dealing with Cinderella. Alright. Stroke of Midnight, keyblade that makes it easier to land quickly. I think it's the same one I got when I got through this uh, world before. Screw that, I'm not doing that. <clears throat> okay, we have now Enchanted Dominion and the Mirage it's the Mirage Arena. Okay, yeah, I'm not doing it. we've already seen the Mirage Arena in, in Aqua's story, so that's uh, pointless. Let's do the Enchanted Dominion, which is next. And I got time to get this started, so let's do it. This is this world. I wish it saved before I landed, but oh well. Still no sign of terror. She's tired? Now she's stolen her heart. Hmm. Well then, why don't I go get it back for her? That's impossible, dear. Maleficent's home is at the Forbidden Mountain. It's not safe. I'm not afraid. We can't just leave Aurora like this. I can help. You gotta believe me. Come on. Let's go get her heart. You know... You're absolutely right. The Forbidden Mountain is through the forest. Come along. Follow us. After all, we wouldn't want you to get lost. God forbid. I know, lousy punch slime. I don't care. Still sleeping there. What's over here? A thing. Okay, well, I thought about a chest over here or something. Don't see any. Well, camera turned on me all of a sudden. That's the way. One of two ways out. All right. Uh, let me go ahead and check the item shop real quick. To see if there's any abilities I want to get. I think so far no cure. No uh, level two abilities. Does have cure? Do we have cure though? I think I'm gonna go ahead and get cure. It's like I said uh, before, cure is uh, all. All I have to do on cure is wait for a recharge. I don't have to worry about running out of items. So I'm going to go ahead and get the cure ability here. Command Dex, edit deck, change the potion for cure. There we go. Hmm. 
Okay. We can do a mail command. What can we what can we mail? Yeah, I know how it works. Okay, strike raid. Okay, I don't want to do that. What about strike raid and sliding dash? We don't get we don't know what the command is. Hmm. Well, here's what I'm gonna do. Since I can buy um what are those two abilities? Strike raid and sliding dash. I'm gonna go buy those abilities. <clears throat> that way, I don't worry. That way, if I if I don't like the ability that I get from the new command by mixing these two together, I don't have to worry about wasting these abilities because they're already level three. So I'll go buy those uh, level one abilities from the shop, mix them together, see what the new command is, and if I like it, good thing. If not, then I haven't lost my. I don't have to worry about having to level up those abilities again. So let me go ahead and buy. With strike raid and sliding dash, I believe. All right, mail commands. Okay, well, I will have to level them up anyway because I can't. I can't obviously uh, meld abilities below level three. Oh well, at least I still have them in case they decide to. Because uh, I don't like these abilities, so strike raid, sliding dash. What kind of item do we want to put with it? Deal with fire and other elemental. Reduce reload time for your commands. <laughs> Longer combos. I haven't had an issue with combos not doing enough damage with Ventus, so I think I'm, I'm not. Okay. I don't think I'm okay with that one. I think I'm going to go ahead and go with the uh, fleeting crystal to reduce the reload time for commands because uh, that's one thing I don't like is the, is the, is the slower recharge. I mean, the recharging fine, but faster the better, obviously. So. All right, what do we get? We get Payback Raid and Magic Haste. Okay, well, at least Cure will be charged faster, which is good because God knows Cure char charges so damn slowly. All right, so let's go ahead and put those abilities back on there. Uh, strike Raid and Sliding Dash. And then... Uh, What was it? What was it? Uh, right, action commands. No, come on. Edit that. Here we go. Action commands. This payback raid for this payback raid, which will give us match haste. All right. Which I think is right down here. You got magic haste. Shortens the reload time for all magic commands installed in your deck. Multi-install the ability for oh, for even quicker reloading. Okay, nice. It'll it'll uh actually a stack if I have more than one magic haste okay and obviously we know what scan is all right good I like that I like that a lot all right so it sucks that I had to go back to level one with uh, strike rate and sliding dash but uh, at least uh, I now have a uh, quicker recharge with my magic abilities especially considering like I said cure takes so damn long to charge okay that's going to be here and save real quick. And I will be right back. Alright, I will save it up ready to go. I was facing toward this door when uh, I started. So I'm wondering if I should maybe go this way first. See what's over here. Uh, chest is uh, over here, which is good. I got sleep. Alright. And then a nice view of the outside. That's all there is to that. At least I did get the item. What's is this store worth anything? Nope. Okay. Hmm. No shadows. Hmm. That's too bad. Oh well. No points of detail there. But we do have enemies. Let's take these guys out. Alright, 44 points away from a level up, that's good. We'll probably get a, a battle, one or two battles. Uh, enough, I'll get one, one experience per uh, enemy here, never mind. Alright, high potion. Yeah. 
Where's it? There it is. Not sure where's that last one, but there he is. Alright, what's here? Oh, this is a big area. I haven't found a large chest yet for a, uh, or a map yet. It would be really nice if I had one. There's a sticker up there. Store here? Nope. I guess this is the throne. <laughs> for some reason, the throne always has really tall chairs. A thunder now, so that's good. Oh, the side rooms over here. I see a chest on the left side, so there's probably going to be a chest over here on the right side as well. Almost always seems to be. And this is one exception where there's not. Okay. Oh, this is the uh, item dropping guys. Okay. I have no idea what these items are that I'm getting. Forest muffin, jumbo almond. Level up strength increased. All right, level ten. Okay, so what are those items that I'm getting? Are those are those the uh, synthesis items? How do I find out stock? Yeah, okay, jumbo almond. All right, so these are. This is prize obtained from a prize pod. Looks like it could be used as an ingredient. Okay, so it's probably used for mixing. Yeah, doing some kind of combining that. I think I saw it once with uh, in Aqua's story. I was with the uh, uh, Huey, Dewey, and Louie, the, the little the little ducks. And I think uh, that's what uh, that's what they're for is using these to combine into something. But I didn't have enough items to combine into anything, so I don't really know, you know what I'm able to combine with them. High potion. Let's head out the door. It's a long bridge. That's the enemies along the way, of course. Gotta have something to do other than just running along, along, along the bridge. <laughs> now, I know the graphics quality of this game isn't Xbox One quality. I mean, it looks just barely PS2 quality. But you gotta remember, this game was made originally for the PSP. It's an HD remake, so they just improved... The, all they did was take the graphics of the original PSP game and then just improved it to you know, smooth, out the, smooth out the rough edges, basically, for the, uh, uh, for, the for the Xbox and uh, PS, or actually, they didn't make it for the Xbox, but the PlayStation 4. I think this game was playable on the Xbox 360 as well. I think they made an HD remake for the, the 360, PlayStation 3, I'm sorry. Um, but I went with this version because it includes uh, a couple of more games for the PlayStation 4 that were not available for the PlayStation 3 version of the HD remakes. So, all right, save point here. I'll go ahead and uh, heal up here and save, and I'm going to head through the next area. I don't see any. Oh, there's a chest over there. It's a big chest too. Maybe this is a map chest. Let's go ahead and grab this first. And tap. Yes, it is. It is a map. Awesome. Okay. Now that I got that, I will head over here and we'll head that away and see what's that away in the next episode of Kingdom Hearts Breath by Sleep. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Check out the links in this video for more of my stuff. And thanks so much for watching. I'm Score, the Renegade. I'll see you later. <laughs>